Hello, everybody. Welcome into your special edition uh, extra headlines on this Friday, January 12, 2024. Another snowstorm here. A rinse and repeat week uh, for snow. Uh, apparently, we're just going to get it all in one week. Who knew? Well, we got to get through it, nevertheless. And uh, let's start uh, talking about some of the closures uh, that we have in place here as of today. So, city buildings uh, are closed today, Friday, January 12, 2024, due to the weather. Uh, this is all city buildings, including City Hall, Community Center, Senior Center, Library. It'll be closed today, and uh, all public meetings are canceled for today, although there were no actual public meetings scheduled today. So we don't have to worry about that. Uh, details on the Fitchburg Public Library and its closure. The Fitchburg Public Library will not only be closed today, Friday, January 12th, but also Saturday, January 13th. All library program is canceled for both days. Items on hold will be expended, uh, extended, so holds will not expire during the closure. Don't forget the library is a fine free library as well. So we do not charge for late fees for overdue items. Solid waste collection uh, is expected to be delayed because of the weather. Uh, it says here, Appellatier has made a decision due to, uh, to, uh, to delay Friday collection routes until Saturday. It is possible that some residents on, uh, uh, on Thursday uh, will not, uh, may have not received collection either. Uh, nevertheless, uh, let's talk about the routes uh, uh, specifically uh, for this week. So. <clears throat> Uh, Friday routes, all Friday residential collection routes have been rescheduled to Saturday, uh, uh, January 13th. Pelletier may not be able to collect service, uh, collect, uh, com able to complete service if roads are impassable or carts are tipped over upon arrival. Residents uh, whose carts are not picked up by 7 p.m. on Saturday should remove them from the curb due to the number areas uh, at in accessible weather conditions, Pelletier will be unable to return to pick up those carts. However, impact residents can place five, up to five extra bags of trash and recycling next to their cart on the next regular scheduled pickup collection day. Pelletier apologizes for the inconvenience. Also, they've seen an uptick in tipped over carts. Pelletier is experiencing a high volume of carts being tipped over prior to trucks arriving. Drivers are not able to collect carts that are knocked over or cannot get out of their out at every stop to upright them. If you can, please set the carts upright prior to uh, our arrival so they can be serviced. And uh, please do not place them in the road or in the snow banks. <clears throat> you may also shovel out around the carts. Keep uh, four feet away from uh, each cart. <clears throat> Uh, if you can, uh, again, uh, if uh, anything obstructs them, they're tipped over during service, they may not get picked up. And uh, Pelletier Waste uh, has uh, information on weather delays and more. You can go to pelletier.com backslash uh, weather uh, to get the latest information there on the collection routes. Otherwise, again, could be a slight delay today uh, going for tomorrow. Uh, and if they don't make it through, you can put extra uh, up to five bags of trash next to the cart for pickup the following week if they do not make it to your home. And finally, Wisconsin DOT uh, is reminding you to be safe and also get ready for that cold weather that's coming in too. So this storm is not only packing a very uh, big punch of snow, but also we're going to see the coldest weather come in yet uh, this year. Another, another snowstorm is moving across the area and the National Weather Service uh, forecasts widespread snowfall, strong winds that may cause reduced visibility, blowing and drifting condition. Road conditions will significantly impact uh, be impacted during the storm. Wisconsin Department of Transportation advises drivers to know before you go with the 511. Uh, using the 511, travelers can monitor roads with 511wi.gov or via 511 Wisconsin mobile app and view the video and traffic cameras along the routes. Prepare for extreme cold as well. Better cold temperatures and wind chills arrive on Saturday, January 14th throughout the state and will last through next week. Drivers are reminded to keep an emergency kit in their vehicle and alert others about the route they are expected to travel. A well-maintained vehicle is always important as well, especially during these harsh winter conditions. If traveling is coming up, drivers should keep a full tank of gas, at least half full. The, this will help prevent the lines from freezing and provide extra fuel in case you're stranded. If that uh, battery, uh, uh, have ensured that the battery anti-freeze cooling system are all in good working conditions as well. And please give our snowplows plenty of space as they make their way through the 115,000 miles of roads across Wisconsin. And thank you and stay safe, everyone.